I certainly am, John. How are you? I'm all right, thank you. I spoke to you the other week about the uh, so-called feral kitten at Orange RSPCA. Yes. I'd like to tell you right now that that little fella is in my car. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah, we went through all the channels to help from your guys in there. And they rang me the next day after you guys spoke to them. And we now have a very healthy little boy in our car. And we're out of Dubbo at the moment. We had to come out here to pick him up. We're taking him back home to Summerland Point today. Okay, is he little? He's little. He's, uh, he was born in September. And we're just looking at him, he's about the same size as his brother that we have at home. Oh, well, that's terrific news. For those who don't know, David called up uh, seeking our help in rescuing a cat which was bound to be put down. Uh, and we worked very hard with David, I might say, and the RSPCA to make sure that the cat wasn't put down. Today we've been uh, given the kitten. Well, David's been given the kitten. What have you called him? Uh, we've called him Lawsy. <laughs> oh, I'm flattered. No, because you helped us, John. Oh, well, I'm glad I helped you, David, and I'm glad I helped save the little kitten. Love him a lot. Make him purr. We are going to do that. We'll give him his space when we get home, and he'll, he'll settle in. He's got nine other friends at home to settle in. Oh, nine? So. Nine other friends? Oh, well, he'll get on with them very, very well and very quickly. Good on you, David. Thanks for telling us about it, and I'm glad that we were able to help in the saving of a little pussy cat. because anybody who's a regular listener to the program knows that I am a real sook when it comes to animals, particularly little pussycats. I love them. The reason I love them is that I've got Ernest. Ernest is the world's most perfect cat. And James doesn't agree. The John Moore's Morning.